What is up Division 2 Agents, this is Gamer for Life back with another Division 2 video. I just wanted to make this quick video as a reminder that you have just one week left to get all of those Winter Project exclusive items. And if you are struggling with any of them or you don't know the location for some of those items, I will link a video in the description where I put all 15 Winter Projects and how to complete them in one video. And there are timestamps in a pinned comment on that video so you can go directly to the one that you need to complete. So definitely go check that out. In those winter projects towards the end you will unlock the new backpack festive delivery which is on a group O piece. And the loot goblin is still currently dropping it but again he only drops it after you've unlocked it. But that's not the only thing that he's dropping. There is also three other exclusive winter items that he drops, which are the Chill Out Mask, the Slayer, and the Old Carol Sniper. So if you are still needing any of them along with the festive delivery backpack, I will also leave a link in the description of a video I made showcasing every location that I know of to where he spawns from and you can continuously farm the loot goblin by logging out and logging back in after you take him out and you can do this for as long as you want to farm him. Also something else that is ending soon is the jewel mist hunter's mask after defeating the hunters on floor 100 in the summit. So if you don't have that and you have a buddy who has a checkpoint at or close to floor 100, I would definitely get that checkpoint as it does not matter if you actually did all the floors yourself, as long as you take out the hunters on floor 100, you will get that mask. Something else ending next week is the fire bundle that has three weapon skins, an emote, and what most people want, it also has that new Santa mask. Pretty cool. The last thing that I'll mention that is ending soon, though you do have until February 16th, is the Recruiter Mask, which also comes with the entire outfit, so it's not just a mask. And I know the price to some is kinda hefty. Some feel it's a good way to support the game, and some feel it's just an outrageous price and should have been the reward for completing the manhunt. But regardless, for anyone wanting it, you have a bit over a month to get it. So that's going to do it for this video, my friends. I just wanted to put that reminder out there for you guys. I hope everyone is doing good, staying safe out there. It is good to be back from a long vacation, and I can't wait to dive back into everything that is The Division. So yeah, hope you guys had a great holiday, and as always, my YouTube family, take it easy.